in the quiet of an early morning. There is something special about writing a letter by hand. The soft sound of the paper, the feel of the pen moving across it. These little things make the moment unique. As you write, you are not just putting words on the page. You are sharing a part of yourself. Each line you write reflects your thoughts and emotions. It's a deliberate act that shows how much you care. In today's fast world, taking this time feels like a pause, a brief moment where it's just you and your thoughts. A handwritten letter is more than just words on paper. It's the connection that transcends time. Over the years, it can become a cherished keepsake, a reminder of the moments and emotions that were shared. These letters often hold memories that digital messages can't capture. They become a part of your personal history, something you can't hold on to when everything else seems to change. On the other hand. Unread emails remain somewhere in the vast expanse of cloud storage systems, consuming energy and contributing to environmental harm. They are easily overlooked or deleted, leaving no lasting mark. It's strange to think about the sheer number of unread. Messages that exist, lingering in digital limbo, waiting to be opened. Messages that may never be. Seen, let alone remembered. Yet, there are letters that, though they never reach the intended recipient, still get sent. This is a form of obsession, known as jobnium, in Vietnamese, where the sender holds onto the act of writing and sending letters. Even knowing the recipient will never read them, this isn't just about grief. Sometimes it's a way to keep moving forward, to remember those who have passed on, and to maintain a connection that 
though unfulfilled, still holds deep meaning. Bên cạnh ai liệu còn biết anh vẫn 